Lucifer has been around for five seasons and after a shaky start, when the series premiered, it eventually made its way to Netflix where it was given a new lease on life and appealed to a much different audience. Today, the show is gearing up for its sixth and final season, but many fans are left wondering, why is the show ending? Today, we'll take a deep dive into the history of Lucifer and see if we can uncover the truth about this beloved series and why the creators are pulling the plug after just six seasons. Before we get started, be sure to hit that like button and ring the notification bell for more videos. I suppose this won't bother you. Lucifer has been running strong for five seasons, but Netflix is already working hard on the final season that will see all of our favorite characters wrap up their storylines and live happily ever after. Maybe. We'll just have to wait and see. For the moment, every season of the show has performed remarkably well on Netflix, so it seems crazy that the network would end the show after filming just six seasons. We know that Tom Ellis has had one foot out the door for the last couple of years, but is Ellis really the reason why the show will be coming to an end? Considering most of the world was shut down throughout 2020, it became incredibly hard for film crews to continue working on some of our favorite shows, Lucifer included. The show faced countless setbacks and ultimately the fifth season needed to be split into two parts to give the editors enough time to finish up post-production. On top of this, we know the writers had their own struggles to work through as they weren't able to be in the same room as one another while working through the fifth season. I'm sure many of us likely realize that season 5 was supposed to be the final season for Lucifer. However, it seems like Netflix had a change of heart once the season finally premiered. It seems like many fans felt as though season 5 was a bit rushed and wasn't as polished as the previous two seasons that Netflix had produced. This show was still great in its own regard, but it didn't quite live up to the expectations that had been set forth. For this reason, many viewers felt as though the show had been leading up to some sort of grand conclusion, yet the series fell on its face at the conclusion of season 5. This is likely one of the main reasons Netflix decided to renew the series for one final season, to tie up loose ends and give fans what they had been asking for. If we look to the stars and the showrunners for a better explanation, it seems like they were all on the same page. Most of the crew felt as though season 5 would be the final season for the show, but Netflix called at the last minute and offered to bring the series back for one final season. Joe and Ildi Modrovic, the masterminds behind Lucifer, spoke in an interview with Entertainment Weekly after being offered a final season and said, We were like, no, this is perfect. If we do this, extend to season 6, it'll ruin everything. Then three days later, you're like, wait, how could we not have done this? It's the story we were always going to tell, but just written much larger and to me so much more interestingly. It breaks my heart to think we weren't going to do it this way, idly added. We want to really explore how our characters end up where they ended up. You're gonna pay, Dromas. Really? My money's on me, pal. Needless to say, these two seem to have been very shocked when Netflix offered to keep running for one last season. It seems as though these two did the best they could with the resources they had to tie up any loose ends, but it just didn't go over well. With a new season just on the horizon, I think we can expect Lucifer to finally reach the conclusion that it deserves and put the minds of countless fans to rest with a series finale that is actually worth watching. Not that season 5 didn't do a decent job at explaining the paths of our favorite characters were heading down, but it left a lot to be desired. Tom Ellis has also spoken about his time on the show and seems to have had every intention of leaving the series after the fifth season. After a series of contract negotiations, he finally agreed to come back for one more season, but he says he fully plans on stepping away from the show once that season is concluded. In an interview, Tom says that he had already planned on taking a little bit of time off to grieve the loss of the show, but he was completely shocked when he found out Netflix wanted to bring it back yet again. I told you. He said, I'd planned to spend this season in my own grieving process and then, right towards the end, literally as we'd already devised how we would end our show, we had a call from Netflix saying, would you like to go another season? He later spoke about his time with the series when speaking with The Wrap and said, Imagine running a marathon and then getting right to the end, and then they go, 
Oh, by the way, the finish line is a little bit further. He spoke about how season 4 was originally supposed to be the final season and how the show was renewed once again for season 5. He said, We've been through this whole journey of cancellation, then hashtag save Lucifer, which was obviously incredible, and then when they renewed us, they said it was going to be the final season. And it was only going to be 10 episodes, but then it was 16, and then they split it in half. So it's this constant moving thing, but I have to appreciate that the reason it's a constant moving thing is the show has become so popular, so they just can't kill it. It just won't die, it's been incredible. Tom continued talking about the show and added, The hashtag Save Lucifer campaign was just the most incredible thing that's happened and then the fact that it's been vindicated by how popular it's become on Netflix. I mean, I think it was already popular, but its popularity has grown and that's the thing that keeps me going. Because if it was just down to, there's the finish line, oh no, it's further and further and they keep moving it, it's quite exhausting emotionally as well. But I'm happy that people are watching the show and it's become the success that it is. I don't mean to read between the lines too much here, but it seems as though Tom is ready to leave the legacy of Lucifer behind him. When talking about the show, he repeatedly described it as a race. He also mentions how it just won't die at this point. It doesn't seem like he's starring in the show for his own gratification anymore, but rather for the enjoyment of fans. Not to be too pessimistic here, but it seems like he's ready to move on and explore other avenues in his career. It's amazing that he cares about the fans enough to continue creating a show that his heart simply isn't in any longer, but it seems like Tom's ready to move on to bigger and better projects. Careful consideration, we've decided this whole flaming sword plan is a crap idea. Yes, crap. If we think about this objectively, you have to admit, the show has been going on for a very long time. And if it were to ever end, now would likely be the best time before the writers simply start beating a dead horse. Most Netflix shows don't make it nearly as long as Lucifer has and some are even cancelled before the series gets renewed for a second season. For this reason, it's so awesome to see that Lucifer was given a fighting chance to stand on its own, especially after being cancelled more than once. This just goes to show that fans truly do have a lot to do with the direction that some of these shows take and we have more of a voice than we'd like to believe sometimes.